was Geelong's number one goal kicker in the 2020 season. Now with the Dogs. Pritchard, the only player that went up. Cats, though, somehow win out. But they're kicking to a Bulldogs wall at the moment, and Pritchard is an integral member of that wall. And she hit a target, hoping for a lead. And it's a beautiful lead and a beautiful kick to the advantage of Newton. For a sixth goal of the season, and Gabby Newton, fifth in fact, she gets it for the Bulldogs, and they have the early scoreboard advantage here at Mars Stadium. For Maloney, so backs her speed and pace and goes deep inside, 50. Parry at the back, Amy McDonald. Got a hand pass away to Scott. Second time lucky, snaps it. And she's playing some terrific footy inside forward 50 now. Shelley Scott, she gets the Cats first. Goes long. What a terrific play from the Dogs. Awesome from Ellie Blackburn. Take a mark, take another, and then break that line after that. There's a free player all by herself in the middle of the Ford 50 arc. No play within 20 metres of Chloe Shear. And now she's got a set shot directly in front. 24 go goals overall in her AFLW career. Strikes it pretty well, squeezes it through. The Cats hit the front in Ballarat. Through the hands of Parry, into Hunt. Lamb brought down, terrific tackle from Skinner. And she wins the ball back for the Cats. Back to Fitzgerald. Takes the bounce. We know she loves to run. Kicks long inside 50. Bounce really important here. Morris Dalton with another clever tap. It is to Woodley who goes with the outside of the boot and bounces it through for a rip. Oh, it is. It's touched off the boot. It is touched off the boot. In the meantime, Geelong able to rebound. The dog's so well set up. It goes past three of them, though. Shelley Scott running onto it. And she has lots of green grass in front of her. Kicks towards goal. Hopes for the lucky bounce. And she gets it. No, not quite. Another touch. Last line of defence. Getting back. Millie Brown saves the day. Beautiful day in Ballarat. For this top eight clash. As Fuller goes high and long inside 50. Over the head of Shear. Into the lap of Scott. Who sweeps it back towards Shear. Went back and got it. Shelley Scott. Another sweeping handball. Shear in the pocket. Lurking dangerously. Scott steamrolls through. Great Scott. Oh, she can't finish. Towards the wing. Shear brings it to ground. Only his father is Edmonds. Lamb on the left. Beautiful kick. Well weighted. And what about the hands of Cranston? Helps Johnson back to her feet. And then looks to pass it off. And it's a good pass as well. Three-time Bulldogs best and fairest winner. Three-time All-Australian. Still just 27, Ellie Blackburn. Her best years are ahead of her. Great kick. Great finish. The captain stands up when needed most. Have their support once again. Morrison with a wonderful sidestep. Sends it inside 50 to Shear. Or oh, Scott, take your pick. Scott snaps and goals for the Cats. Working hard with Webster in this Geelong on-ball brigade. Going back with courage there. Bragg taking a terrific intercept mark. Waste no time. Left foot kick. Shear at the back. Plucks it. Terrific grab. Amy McDonald arrives. Good paddle forward from Amy McDonald as well. To Fuller. Great athleticism from the ruck. To Skinner. From the pocket. What a finish. Mia Skinner. winning those clearances and hopefully they're singing their song at the end. That was the main message. Yeah, you're certainly right about the contest there. Up by plus 11, the Cats in this game so far. There's one for Amy McDonald. Handball is illegal. Crocker grills. The amount of time she gets tackled and is able to stand up and then find a, find a teammate. That's fantastic. From directly in front, Crockett grills. Drills it. And the Cats now have a 19-point advantage. Newton, Moody, Georgia Staffers has Berry on her inside. Goes herself, though. There's a heaps of free Bulldogs inside 50. One of them is Berry. Chips it over the top. And in the end, Wilcox 
had to mark that. And she can have a look at the goals. Pick 29 in the recent 2022 draft. Slit that she kicked. And it was all part of the plan. From directly in front. Sneaks it in. This one isn't over yet. Seven points to margin with three and a half to play. The Dogs will have one last look here. Lynch drops it though. Fitzgerald will have a look at the goals, will she? Gives it to Bennett instead. And it floats through, does it? It floats through. They celebrate. It's a goal for Bennett on the siren, but it's a one-point loss for the Bulldogs. And finally, Geelong have defeated the Bulldogs in the AFLW.